Well, hello and welcome to this week's edition of On Deck with a Boya, your weekly travel update. I'm your host, Chris Green, Director of Network Expansion for Avoya Travel. Thank you so much for your time today. You've picked a great week to tune in. I think that every week, but today is very special. We've got a great show lined up today. Here we are, the 2nd of February, and we have some amazing news and results to share with you about the Avoya Network and Avoya Travel and sales from January of this year, 2023. It is so special that we're switching up our normal format and we're focusing our whole eye on the industry feature on Avoya Travel and the sales to start 2023. We're going to welcome in Steve Hershan, Senior Vice President of Sales for Avoya Travel, here in just a second to share that exciting news and give these record-breaking sales numbers some context. Steve will be on in just a moment. Well, wow. What a show, right? I mean, like we do every week, but we're going to wrap up our show with the, with some calls to action, with details on our latest promotions, our travel agent education powered by Avoya platform, the resources that help our network sell at such an amazingly high level, and of course, with the deepest partnerships with all of the important leisure brands, and of course, make sure you have all the ways to stay in touch and reach out to start the journey with the number one host agency in leisure travel, Avoya Travel. So let's kick it off this week's edition of On Deck with Avoya. And I've been pounding the drum pretty hard because the measurement of a strength of any business or network really comes down to results. We like to say the numbers don't lie. Well, the results for January 2023 are in and they are absolutely amazing. Joining us live from the Avoya Travel Innovation Center is Steve Hershian, Senior Vice President of Sales for Avoya Travel. Steve, we appreciate you jumping back on and, and joining us again and coming back on the show to share this exciting news. And again, like I said, give it some context. Well, I should be a co-host by now. This is my second time since the start of the year. So I'm looking for some uh, co-billing here, Chris. You are you are my David Brenner, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> At least you didn't say Arthur Treacher, but right, I'm not right. sure how many will get that on the call. <laughs> I'm not sure how many can get the David Brenner one either, but at least we understand. That's all that matters, right? <laughs> Steve, I guess with my big buildup, the first thing is, how did we do sales-wise in January? Yeah, so I, I think January was the last dagger in the heart of COVID in terms of sales returning to not just normal, but returning to where we all thought the industry was going back in uh, early 2020. Uh, we completely blew away our record month in January. And, and Chris, you know, we couldn't do it without, number one, the support of great suppliers like David and Sandals will be on later. And of course, our fantastic uh, agency network who do all the sales for Avoya. Avoya doesn't do any selling directly to consumers. Uh, they are our sales force and they do a tremendous job uh, the average sales in the network are higher than any place else in the industry, and we're really proud of that. Absolutely. And speaking of the Avoya network, I mean, just what are some of your, your thoughts, Steve, on the performance overall of the Avoya network from January? So what, what was the most impressive thing to me is looking at agencies that just started last year and their performance, already a significant amount of business is coming from people who just started sometime between January 1st and December 31st last year. And if that wasn't you know, impressive enough, the sales from agencies that you, you and your team have brought on in January are astounding that people are hitting the ground running that quickly, making sales and making money. That's a, that's a fantastic little nugget to share. When you dive a little bit deeper into the numbers, Steve, if you've had a chance or you and, and, and you know, some of the various teams that you and meetings that you sit on. Have you noticed any early trends that you might be able to share? Absolutely. I, I would say the, the biggest trend is that the average ticket price for a booking is up significantly. And, and we've seen that over the last couple of months, maybe even the last half year. And what, what we firmly believe is people who saved all that travel money for two years during COVID when they couldn't go anywhere they're not going back to their normal travel expenditure. They're going and either doubling up their expenditure for, for one trip or taking more trips than they normally do. Uh, they, they, I think and what I've heard from other studies is that people learn during COVID that experience is more important than material items. When they got shut out of the chance to be with people, whether to go out to dinner, travel to visit family or go on vacation, they realize, you know what, 
these are really the more important things in life than one more flat screen TV. Yeah, you know, early in the pandemic, right, there was the term used to talk about certain employees that they were essential. I think now that we're a couple of years down the road, we get an idea of what really is essential to individuals, you know, and, and that certainly is travel and those experiences and those moments that they spend with their families. Completely agree. You know, you mentioned the point, and I just want to drive that point home again, is that all of the sales, not only in January of this year, but always in the Avoya network are made exclusively by those in the Avoya network. There's not employees working directly for Avoya travel that are selling and, and taking advantage of, of our unique specials and cherry picking live leads. So again, when we, we look at this full circle, pretty impressive, right, Steve? It, it, it's, it's very impressive. So two things I think are impressive. One is the number of support people we have per agency in the network is way higher ratio than any other host or franchise. Uh, two, when I, when I mentioned the success of last year's class and, and this year's January class so far, it really epitomizes and it makes me very proud because a lot of these departments fall under my purview is all the effort that's put into helping people, many of whom are new to travel, helping them get their business up and running and do it so successfully and so quickly. And, and the reason why quick is important, number one, from a confidence point of view, Chris, you and I both sold when we started with Avoya as our own independent agency owners. And I never forget the, the first day I was on claiming Avoya Live Leads, I made a booking. It was okay, it was a two day cruise. It wasn't a lot of money, but the confidence of making a booking that quickly was huge. And we also know the cash flow implications of starting a new business. You know, it's great if I start my business today and I'm booking cruises for 2025 and I don't get paid until then. So the fact that people are booking so quickly means that cash is coming into their bank accounts that much quicker. That is a real win-win when you talk about that. And I guess it's safe to say, Steve, I mean, as, as we certainly ramp up for the rest of 2023 that it's looking like it's going to be a special year, right? I mean, January is just, just not like a one trick pony. No, it's not because uh, I think yesterday was our second biggest day of the year. So normally wave season kind of goes out to March, maybe even to April. Uh, I, I'm wondering if it's going to end this year really, because there's so much pent up demand people and so much of people booking multiple trips in a year instead of one trip in a year. I, I, I'm hoping it's wave year, not wave season. The wave tsunami right. <laughs> or the, the sales tsunami. I like it. Uh, based on what you've seen to start the year, any advice that you would offer to those that have been kind of sitting on the fence about either joining our network, the Avoy network, or just getting into the travel business to begin with? Well, the first thing I would say is I don't, I can't think of any other business where you can start a business with such a, a low basic investment to get started. And I, and I know you'll talk more about the joining aspects of Avoya, but whether it's Avoya or somewhere else, really, I mean, for our agencies, it's it's a laptop and an internet connection and, and, and a small fee to join, and they're instantly in business. It's not like spending thousands of dollars to buy a franchise or opening a storefront and, and then having to spend money to market to drive consumers to your business. Like I said, my first day on the phones, my phone is ringing, I'm making a booking. I didn't spend any money out of my pocket to drive demand, the demand is there. Uh, you know, one thing I always kind of look ironically at, you know, we, we are, our marketing people are able to generate more leads than we seem to have people that want to claim them sometimes, they're, they're so busy. So looking for some help out there. Yeah, absolutely. Steve Hershan, Senior Vice President of Sales for Avoya Travel. Any last thoughts, Steve, on this record-breaking month or anything else uh, going on in your world you want to share? Well, I think the other, the other nice thing about the travel business is you can do it to augment retirement income, spouse's income or partner's income. Uh, you have to, you'll get out of it what you put into it. But different people in our network work in different ways. Some are working 24 seven, some are working fewer hours and, and, and enjoying their life as well. So it, it's, 
it's an inexpensive business to start. It's a flexible business to run. And you're selling people a product that they love. Not a bad combination. That's a pretty good combination. Steve Hershan, everyone. Steve, thanks again for your time and for jumping on and sharing this amazing news to the start of 2023 in the Avoya Network. My, my pleasure, Chris. Thanks and have a great 2023, everyone. Thank you. Just amazing. And again, it just highlights how the travel industry continues to innovate and find ways to help more people enjoy this beautiful world we live in. There are so many exciting things going on right now. And extended through February is our promotion for high-end agents. Again, we say it every week. I'll, I'll say it again. Looking for agents that did over $100,000 in gross sales in 2022 in key leisure products, cruise, river cruise, tour, all-inclusive, beaches, sandals, that kind of leisure travel where people are going on vacation. If you did over $100,000, uh, then we're in a position where we could waive the fee for you. Just get qualified through an affiliation specialist. It's an amazing deal to join the number one host agency in leisure travel and be part of the company that just posted its number one record sales month in all of its history. I mean, it's pretty amazing. So again, reach out. That's going on through February. We still have going on our military promo. We love our friends, our veterans, those in the military, their spouses, because we know they serve right along with them. We still have $100 off the affiliation fee with our veterans discount. Again, somebody on my team is more than happy to work with you, get you qualified for that promotion. So again, avoidnetwork.com is your first stop uh, in order to reach out for that. Circling back on for those that are new to the travel industry, and if you're hearing about all these sales and, and you're hearing the exciting things that David Rich had to talk about from the Sandals brand, and you're like, man, my heart just gets excited for something like that. I want to be part of it. You can. And we have the best value for getting into the industry you're going to find. The travel agent education powered by Avoya, dynamic, comprehensive curriculum, it's only about 40 hours of online self-paced lessons. So you really can, if you're focused, you can get through this. It's the travel agency uh, proficiency test uh, exam that's covered. And you get free memberships in CLIA, the Cruise Line International Association, and ASTA, the American Society of Travel Advisors. And if you complete the program in the first 60 days that you're signed up, and then you affiliate with Avoya Travel, we're able to take $100 off that affiliation fee as well. So don't wait, get started, get part of it, become part of this industry 2023. It's so exciting. And we just can't wait to hear from you and help share our story about why now is the moment. Now is go time, people, I'm telling you. So uh, please reach out with that information. Um, we have the resources, whether you're experienced, whether you're new to the industry, whether you're a little bit experienced, but you'd like to be a lot more experienced and really take your sales to somewhere else. Live leads, amazing marketing as assets, the support that is provided by Carrie Fredericks and her team, again, I'll just do a little call out for Carrie, just truly amazing, wonderful people, they care, they want to help. If you want to help you, they want to help you too. Um, easy to use technology, the development, professional development, we love featuring our friends that are providing the sales coaching and the business coaching, it takes everything we do just to another level. So reach out and get that conversation started today, no matter where you are in the travel industry. And if you're following us and, and you're giving us a little, you know, love by watching our show uh, on deck with Avoya, make sure you subscribe and you like and you ring the bell and all of those cool things. We're on all of the main social media platforms. We always have some great content on there and you're never going to miss a beat if you follow us like on our LinkedIn page or Facebook or YouTube, any of those cool places. So please do that. And then reaching out, avoyanetwork.com. It's still the best place to do that. Or you can just reach out to me personally, chris.green at avoidtravel.com. Give us a call. Follow us. Let's get in touch. February is going to be just as amazing as January. I just got a feeling. I mean, you heard Steve say second best day of the year uh, to kick off February of 2023. Be part of the magic. Big thanks again to Steve Hershan, who joined us with our record-breaking sales numbers. Annabella did a wonderful job producing our segment from our trade marketing team. Thank you for being part of it. We'll see you next week. Until then, take care, everyone.